Hi guys, um, so we're going to have um, chicken spaghetti on a budget tonight. Um, we just don't have a lot of money these days sometimes. So um, instead of um, fresh chicken, we're going to have canned chicken. Um, I'm a Kroger baby, so I usually will get the value pack of six. Um, and that will last a good while. You can get a pack of six for around $12-ish. Um, and you can use it for various things. I use it for um, the chicken spaghetti chicken salad sometimes I put it in rice um, sometimes you know various things like that um, we've got the angel hair pasta I like the barilla because it seems like it's a little thinner than most it'll also have a number one on the side of the box um, that way you know it's um, that that kind um, I also got my favorite um, spaghetti sauce which is the classico I use the sweet basil and the four cheese because they just kind of seem to marry together um, really well. And um, this will last us for a couple days, but um, it'll also feed a, a good family of four, probably really good. Um, again, it's for a cheap meal, um, probably less than $20 or around $20, maybe. Um, it, you know, especially if you count, if you get the full six pack of chicken, um, the chicken cans. Um, but anyway. Um, enjoy, and um, I will kind of go along for the, through the process. I'm going to make sure you drain the water out of each of your cans. Add your sauces in your pan. When you add your chicken in, I shred it. I shred it so that it's not too chunky. Do that with both cans. Then just stir it all together. If you find that you want more chicken, just add more chicken, but this usually two cans puts a lot of chicken in there, as you can see. And then just warm that up. until it's hot. If you want, you can spice it up extra by adding basil or oregano or add your extra um, parmesan if you want um, or some mozzarella or um, mushrooms. Um, you, can, you can add to it however you'd like. Hey. Um, get your water yeah. boiling for your noodles. I cut mine in, uh, break mine in half. So it's easier to go in the pot. Your angel hair pasta only takes about 20 minutes to boil. <clears throat> um, plus it kind of makes the noodles spread a little bit longer and further. Um, like I said, I do about half a box. And I put a little bit of salt in for seasoning. Once your pasta is done, you drain it. Once your spaghetti's drained, you have a couple options. Um, some people will add their spaghetti right into their sauce um, and just mix it up. Um, me, I will add a little bit of butter and um, just kind of put that in with my noodles <clears throat> so it just kind of keeps them from sticking. Or you can add a little bit of olive oil or whatever. Um, and because I don't like a lot of sauce on my spaghetti, um, it kind of allows if you have multiple people, they can add as much or as little sauce to their spaghetti um, as they want. <clears throat> or you can just add it all right into your sauce and not give them options. <laughs> um, at the end, when there's leftover spaghetti, then somebody, if they want, they can make leftovers for lunch or whatever. Um, but this kind of gives a little bit of an option. Um, you can always add a little bit of Parmesan cheese or some garlic or whatever to your spaghetti noodles. Um, or if you got kids that are finicky and don't like sauce, they can have just some butter noodles. Um,